So guys, in today's video, we have got the long-awaited, huge ASOS summer clothing haul 2019. Sit back, relax, enjoy the video, drop it a like. Let's start trying stuff on. I let you get to me once now, baby. But I'll never let you win again. What is up, guys? Welcome back to another video. So, like the previous one, when I started off in that nice vlog format, I'm getting a brew, and then we're going to get on to the ASOS haul. That's why you've clicked on it. You're obviously wanting to see all the summer picks that I've got. And it is a big one because we've got a box. When they send a box, you know you've got a lot of stuff. Like that's, it's probably a sign that you've got too much stuff from ASOS, to be honest. So we've got loads of stuff to go through, but I'm gonna get a rapid brew, and then we'll start cracking on, because I know you've been waiting for this video. You've actually been waiting this for this for time. ASOS Summer Hall, it's like my trademark, isn't it? <laughs> um, but yeah, I go to Croatia tomorrow when you'll be watching this video. So hopefully, there'll be some good bits in here that I can take with me and that I can style for like outfits and stuff like that because I'm gonna be doing a summer outfits video very soon as well. All right, so we've got the brew. Let's start cracking on with trying all this stuff on. I'm very excited. You know, this is like my favorite type of video to make. ASOS is just so easy to shop from. As always guys, I'll link all the products in the description if you do wanna check any of them out. And do not forget to subscribe to the channel if you've not already. Drop this video a like. Let me get the box. I wanna spill my cup of tea. That would not be ideal. Right, so, because I want to dress nice and smart on holiday, I've got a few shirts, a few dress shirts. We've got, yeah, three. It's very creased, that one, isn't it? Bloody hell. We've got a sleeveless tee. We've got some shorts. A nice lightweight jacket. And then we've got quite a few pairs of trousers because, like I've said before, I'm proper digging trousers at the minute. You've got loads. Yeah. Three. We've got four pairs of trousers. Another pair of swimming shorts. Another pair of trousers. We've got some sunglasses because sunglasses are just the one. Proper love wearing them. It helps shape your face, like if you've got chubby cheeks like me. And then we've got actually got some shoes as well, you know. We've got a pair of Nike and some ASOS shoes as well. So we'll start off with the jackets, shirts, move our way down to the trousers. The first item we've got is this bomber jacket in this really nice baby blue colour. It's just really nice for summer, isn't it, this colour? Probably my favourite. It's a tall fit, size large, have a look, I might even like travel in something like this. Fit is very good, length on the sleeves is more or less spot on. It's from ASOS Design, so it's not the best quality. The length is really good for me, like really, really good. Yeah, I'm very happy with it. Let's zip it up, see what it looks like. It's like a track bomber jacket, isn't it? It's not too tight, it's not like muscle fit. It's the one. I really like this. Good start. Right, let's move on to this sleeveless tee. Again, in like a similar colour. It's like pigeons on the roof up there. <laughs> Just wondered what a noise was there. Coco, what are them? What are them birdies up there, Coco? Coco! Birdies! Look! Oh, oh. She's not having it. She's not having it. Alright guys, so this isn't a tall fit, I think this is just normal. Um, the ASOS ones are quite open, so it's nice for holiday because you don't want to get dead sweaty and dead hot. These are really nice for holiday and the colour is perfect for the season. The only problem is like after a couple of wetters, they literally do disintegrate. So no wonder they're only like five or six pounds because the quality just isn't great. So if you're gonna get some of these, maybe get like a multi-pack. I think they do them on the website. Like three for 15 quid or something. Get one of them, be on to a winner. It's not bad though. All right, next up we'll go for all the shirts. So we've got two long sleeved and one short sleeved. This one's really creased, so it might look a bit stupid, but I think it looks like a nice shirt. It's a large long 
from ASOS in a really nice blue colour. Can you tell that blue is like my favourite tone of colour? It's really nice. Alright, so try and see past the creases. I'm not ironing it. One thing I've noticed is the sleeves are really long. Even for me, I've got orangutan arms really long, which is quite a good thing. You can tighten them at the cuff as well, which is good. Some of them don't have that. I think this is just a slim fit. I've tried on like muscle fit and skinny, but for my build, they're just like too tight. I don't want to look like just been sprayed with some blue spray paint. Like I don't want to be an avatar. Um, so yeah, apart from it being so creased, this is a really nice shirt. Really happy with this. From ASOS, absolute bargain, like 15 pounds or something. What I'm gonna do is, all the stuff from this video that I keep, I'm gonna do like 15 outfits for summer. And this rolled up with like some blue trousers will look so nice, like really, really nice. Right, let's try on this long sleeved one from River Island. It's like a satin, navy, really soft material. I actually can't believe how creased this is. Like how does it get this bad? What have ASOS been doing with it? So again, this is just like a slim fit shirt. It's not too tight, size large, it's really nice. I know it does look a little bit weird, like a satin material, but it feels really nice. It will match really nice, like say with a white pair of jeans or a light gray or even light blue. Yeah, it fits really well and the quality looks good as well. I do like, this is from actually River Island, which is decent. All right, next we have got another shirt, but short sleeved from ASOS. Slim fit in that it's rose pink. Alright, so the sleeves have like automatically been rolled up, but I think you can unroll them if you like want to, but this is very nice. I think the colour is perfect for summer. Wear a shorts or jeans, chinos. A very nice fit, like it's not too tight, it's quite breathable. Good length on the body and for the price it's a bargain as well. It's just from ASOS Design. Very nice again guys. All this stuff's been pretty good hasn't it? You know what I did? I took my time on the ASOS website and I chose stuff that I knew was going to fit and going to be nice because I didn't want stuff to get here and it just be like oh for fuck's sake. Again. Alright let's move on to the sunglasses. So I've got three pairs of sunglasses. If you've not got any sunglasses right they're an essential for summer you need them even not for summer like even if the sun is out and you're in your car you need some sunglasses so i'd recommend at least having two pairs one for in the car one for just at home but i've got three pairs here and some of them are just really nice these first ones are i think they're 12 pounds and that is rose gold and black it's got this tag on it which is a bit annoying but these ones fit the shape of my head perfectly. That's one thing about sunglasses, you need to find ones that suit your face shape. So your face shape might be rectangular, it might be oval, might be square, like everyone's different. So square, big rectangle sunglasses like this for me are perfect because I've got quite chubby cheeks and up here is quite narrow. So this helps bring my jawline in and that is what you want. You want stuff that's gonna complement you and make you look the best that you can look. So try different, try a few different pairs out, see which ones suit you the best. Like round ones on me look ridiculous. Like aviators just look stupid. But these are a very nice color, very nice. All right, next up we have got, they're actually the same pair, but in just like matte black and charcoal. So again, really nice. Ooh. Yeah, a really nice pair guys. One, one thing as well, don't, in my opinion, from past previous experience, don't spend loads and loads of money on sunglasses because they're easily lost. Like, get them from H&M, ASOS, Topman, because I've had a pair of Ray-Bans and they're just like 200 quid or whatever, it's quite a lot of money and they're really nice, don't get me wrong, but 
if you're on holiday, you can easily lose them. Like, you could e easily just leave it on the sunbed. You could just like go in the sea, forget you've got them on, and then bang, they've gone. That's what happened to me in Jamaica. I was fuming. <laughs> All right, we've got one more pair. These are quite nice as well. Not as square as the others. You see, like, I can't properly see them on me at the minute, but I think these are quite nice. They're smaller than the others. Um, the other ones suit me better, but again, they're still quite nice. Actually, do you know what? I've got more sunglasses from another brand that sent me some out. Let me show you them as well, quickly. Yeah, so this brand got in touch called Wear Me Pro, and they sent me loads of sunglasses out. Like, it's not sponsored or anything, they just said, if you like it, feature it in a video. We've got five pairs. I'm just gonna show you, like, the packaging is really nice. It comes in these boxes here, like this. Thank you. And then the cases are really cool as well. Come like that. And then you've also got a pouch as well. So I've chose square ones to suit the shape of my face. This is like a navy colour. Quite big again, aren't they? Nice. We've got a black colour. These are really nice, like gunmetal. Ooh. And then we have got. I think that might even be the same pair. Or it might be matte black. They're very nice. Big fan. You've got like a Wayfarer. In black again. You can never have too many sunglasses. Honestly, you actually can't because they're very easily lost. And it's nice to match with a few different outfits. It gives a lot of variety. The last pair came in like a special case like this. And these are a little bit out there. I'm not sure I'm a fan of these, but let's have a look. Very shiny. But yeah, guys, I'll link them in the description. If you do, I'll have a look at them. They're really affordable. So go and have a look there. But let's try on the shorts and the trousers now from ASOS. We'll start off with the swimming shorts and we'll work our way to the trousers and then the shoes as well. I forgot about the shoes. Shoes are quite nice, but if you want to get anything from Sulfit Clothing, guys, that'll be linked in the description. Essential tees, swim shorts, joggers. New joggers are coming soon. I'm getting a sample soon, so very excited about that, but minimal branding. Go and check that out as well. Just had to sneak it in, didn't I? Had to get it in there before I get these on. The dog is in the shop. Coco, trying to film a video. Go, go. Huh. Alright guys, so these are the shorts from ASOS, swimming shorts, size large. Really nice stripe actually. White, blue and light blue. They fit really well, like I've tried a lot of swimming shorts on, but these short ones fit me really well. Step around the dock. Um, yeah, these are nice. Do you like these? Right, so these are a slim fit. I've tried on skinny in the past and they're just way too tight. Like, to be honest, these are even tight and they're only a slim fit. They're probably a little bit too tight for me if I'm being completely honest. A bit too tight like around the leg. And they're a 34 waist, I'm only a 32. So you guys saying I've got skinny legs? Probably see not if they're this fucking tight. Like my legs look skinny here, but up here they're actually quite big so. I've got dominant high quads, glutes and hamstrings, which is a bit annoying, but I need to work on the teardrop. All right, let's move on to the pants. All right, guys, so this first pair is from Only and Sons in, uh, yeah, it's like a slim fit, very, very high quality pant material, you know. They're really nice around the cuff and around the ankle, quite slim and tapered. Around the waist, they're quite big, because I am a 32 and this is a 34, so I just wear a belt with them. But the material's really good. The crotch area is really good, like it's not too dropped. Yeah, these are really nice. I'd get them slightly altered, maybe at the Turkish tailor. Turkish, and they say Turkish because he is actually from Turkey. Um, I'll get them slightly altered here, and maybe the waist brought in a little bit. But apart from that, they're good, and they could be great. 
Not like the Primark ones. Not shit. Right, next we've got Boohoo Pinstripe pair. So I was hoping for these to be really, really good. She's not moving, is she? She's not. Watch this, she'll snap if I do this. She starts growling. Woo! Right guys, so I had high hopes for these Boohoo ones. They're not bad, but I keep having the same problem that the pants are really tight around my calves. So I must have big calves. I've got big calves and big upper quads. Been hitting too much legs. I need to back off on the legs. Maybe. They're nice, they're just, they're not, you want them to be comfy, don't you? And these are just not comfy, so. not moving she's not going to move right let's move on to i think i've got two from river island now go, go. Oh, stretchy stretchy son all right so these are slightly cropped not as cropped as the boohoo ones but quite a nice fit i think river island are good for pants you know probably one of my favorites Really nice design. I like the colour. It's like a stone wash. The material isn't as comfy as the uh, Only and Sons ones. Like it's not as stretchy. Like the crotch isn't as comfy either. It's a little bit too dropped. But they're quite a nice pair of pants. Not bad. The last pair again is from River Island. Let's check those out. So these are the exact same material as the previous ones, but I think they're supposed to be the same pant, to be honest, like exactly the same pant, both skinny fit. But these seem tighter and the crotch is a little bit lower. So I'm not a fan of these. I like the design of them. I think they're really cool, but if they're not comfy and they don't fit right, I'm not going to wear them. And the tailor can't really fix this area here. It's just the material, like it's not stretchy. That's the problem. Let's show you the shoes now. I've been dying to show you these, to be honest. Right, so we've got a pair of Nikes. We have got a Nike React Element 55, size UK 10. Let's have a look. Ooh, ooh, ooh. These look fresh. Let's see what they're like on the foot. Alright guys, so this is what they look like on the foot. I got a size UK 10. I didn't get a 10 and a half, but they were too big, so I sent them back. Um, really nice holiday trainer. Is it just me, or every time I go away, I always want to get a new pair of trainers? Like, it just seems the thing to do, like, holiday, new pair of trainers, to travel in, to wear on the plane or whatever. I don't know, it's just like a thing that I do, so... These are really nice, they'll be nice for the gym as well. Really lightweight, dead comfy. Might get them in a few other colours. Might even get a pair of Vapor Max as well, I'm not sure. But very, very nice. Big fan of these. Right, let's try on the next trainer shoe. Which is, it's actually like another holiday shoe. It's a boat shoe, so just an ace or so shoe in white which I think will look quite nice with a few outfits this is what the boat shoe looks like on the foot these are actually a UK 11 and um, it's a good job I got an 11 as well because the 10 would have been way too small quite nice I don't think they'll be nice to match with some like chino or trouser outfits for holiday um, yeah a little bit different not as nice as the Nikes Nikes, but quite like them, quite a nice holiday shoe, that's all you're going to be wearing them for really, you're not going to be coming back home and be like, oh, I'm going to wear those uh, boat shoes today, I'm going to rock those to work, you're just not, are you, you're not going to be like, oh, Kevin, you see my new shoes, Kevin, <laughs> right guys, so that is going to wrap up the huge ASOS haul, if you do like any of this stuff guys, like I said, it will all be linked in the description, I think I've done a decent job, like, with trousers, it's hard to find good ones. I get so annoyed because some of the materials are just annoying. 
Um, but yeah, there'll be a summer outfits video coming very soon, so make sure you keep your eyes out for that. And I'm, I'm still gonna try and do like an ASOS haul every month if I can, just because whatever new stuff comes in, I'm gonna try and get hold of, just like the latest trends and, and some decent stuff. And if there's any like sales or anything on offer, I think I've got all this stuff for 20% off because I just waited for the sale to come. I'll let you guys know. But if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to drop it a like. It's really gonna help me out if you drop it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And yeah, I'll catch you on the next one. Hope you all have a good holiday if you're going away anywhere. I'm going away tomorrow, so yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. See you later.